Welcome to Pitsia IT. Today I will show you how to use SU10 decoder or uh, alternatively I can say how to do a mass operation on user change or user assignment or user creation. Generally if you have a uh, experience on uh, six months, seven months or might be one or two years experience then definitely you know how to create user ID in SAP using a T code SU01 and uh, if you are a not a basis consultant and you are a fresher then might be you are not aware but uh, mostly two to three year or uh, development and quality system because you know every consultant have a development and quality system most of they have access to user assignment so they can create themselves but the problem is most of people knowing user operations using only SU01 T code because most of people are aware how to use SU01. If you suppose you want to create any user ID, what you do? Just go to T code SU01. Here, just uh, enter the any name or whatever, and then just uh, click on the button and fill the role. If you don't know how to create user ID, then I have already one made a video on user ID creation, and I have detailed captured all the aspects like. Uh, what is the address, how to add it, what parameter uh, we have to add it, uh, default value, role assignment, profile assignment, some limitation, everything I have covered on this video. Unfortunately, this is in Hindi language also. Uh, unfortunately, this uh, is on Hindi language only, uh, but uh, I am planning very soon we will release the new video with English language on as, uh, as for HANA system okay so if you want to watch this video then you can definitely watch and might be will learn it now we'll come back on the main topic how to change or uh, do multiple uh, mass operation in su10 t code using okay so here what you do just enter t code su10 okay the single transaction what t code su01 here su10 okay once you open t code you can look user maintenance mass change initial screen so this is the mass operation t code now one more thing keep in mind this t code using this t code you can perform only user related operations means no role related changes no any other functional related changes only user assignment or user related operation so now i am just giving some brief overview about this t code this is the standard menu of every SAP T code uh, user edit go to information so I am not uh, covering this one now here the first option is create create means once uh, you enter here a uh, number of IDs how if you want to create then you just mention the name here and then just click on the create button and also if you don't know how to create and uh, how if you want to watch uh, if you want to know how to create a multi user then you can watch my previous video about the same topic but it is in Hindi language only here in this video what I will cover I will delete mass mass deletion user ID in this video okay the second button is a change option it will perform in mass changes this is mentioned single so if you have mentioned a four to five ID but if you want to change only particular single user ID then you just click on the single button this will perform on the mass operations same this is the only change password option this is the same uh, authorization this is the selection of all select and deselect all the options and uh, this is the value if you want to particularly remove some value now what is the user selection this is nothing but the shortcut of the suimt code if you are aware about suimt code where we can get the some details and user related and whatever or indirectly we can say suim is nothing but reporting t code okay so if i click on the authorized address data then it will be redirect to suim program if you click on the authorization then again it will come on the suim t code the same logon data options now we have just check test start we have id like uh, how many id we have just click on the execute button now the result is we have four sap id the four sap id 
we want to delete three id two three and four same name so how to delete three id in one single click just mention here paste two then paste three also i uh, i can show you one more options so might be it will be helpful to you just to remove this option suppose you have number of entries like 50 to 60 ids so at that time what you can do if you click and copy paste here then here the limitations is only 1 to uh, 18 column you can fill it uh, if more than 90 or 20 value then two values will be uh, skip by the system this is the limitation of graphical user interface gui so in this scenario what you have to do just click on here here although however here no any option given multi selection but i just show you how you can do it just mention paste and star here okay and now i will click on the here now look all the ids come here right now in this scenario what will i do i will select all and remove this one then click automatically it will come then what we will do click on enter here once click on enter here name will be derived from the su01 data okay or from the table now what i have to do i have to delete but before deletion i want to show you some uh, scenario something like that so now if i want to change only single id like a three then I will what to do just select and just click on the single button if I click on single button then it will double click now here you can just open manually and change it and then you can just go back so in this scenario your entries will be changed by single only not only mass entry this is the actually another options now I want to change mass at that time what I can do just click here now when you open if you have already created id then here you will get the box like that change 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 it means this value you can change it uh, this value you can change it here if you want to change from dialog to system what you will do just click system this automatically it will be select change now i will click on the save then all the uh, all the three ids now will be changed to system user okay same you can perform for everything whatever mentioned here just click on change but click on the value select it will be change here and it will uh, just click on the save it will change same you can perform on the parameter and role now one more thing i want to show you here mentioned add button remove button and change button what is the meaning and what is the different remove change and add if you want to add some role on the multiple user id in the single role here you can add only single role with multiple user id means here you have like a role number one role number two role number three then you can just mention here and just click on the change button and add here same way if you want to remove any particular role then just mention here role name and just click on the remove button and change button and just save it then it will be removed if you not select change button then it will be not removed this is this will keep in your mind most of people i have seen they are forgetting this button and then they are confusing why this decode not working i have heard lots of complaint from this uh, this issues so this is i am just showing just click here and just click on the change button then it will be work otherwise it will not work now just i am just go back because the all the other aspects are the same now if i want to change the password or regenerate password it will click here only here you can regenerate the password but this is not suggestible because it is automatic automatic uh, generation if you want to check how password is work then just click here it initial password set by administrator now once we click on that then it will be look password string okay now click here okay now what the password is automatically set by system look this is totally um, like uh, some scripting like password you cannot remember this password you have to just copy paste only so i am not suggesting generate password using su10 this is the limitation of this decode because there is no any option for uh, your custom password now our password has been changed but 
if you want to delete all the id then in this case what you do just select here just click here once you click you know, for our operation the start the message generate password change 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 this is the log first what you do and this is the second log what you do okay this is the log system now mention initial when you executed it you are you executed for password change the later on you change for deletion so mention user deleted user deleted user deleted now if you go here and just go back and refresh now your id will only one id three ids delete them so how this decode work so the limitation of this decode is you cannot set your choice password means custom password it will generate automatically script there is no any option the another option is if you want to add single role to 100 multiple user id it is possible but if you want to if you have a 100 id and 100 different roles you cannot assign using this decode so this is the limitations for password related issues how we can set it i will cover on the another next video